All right, hello all. So, I've managed to uh, start and get destroyed two rock cruisers within like the first three sectors. I'm not too happy about it, and I hope that this run will be just a little bit better, but um, it's not looking too good. All right, let's go rock cruiser. Um, I'm not going to waste too much time on these guys. We're just going to go with the simple names. Pilot, rock pilot. I don't know. Gravel Duster. And we'll call you... Granite Shield. Just a sort of different, but not, you know, too much rename. Stone Chance. Start. Font size. Pressing plus or minus custom model and options will let you change the event size text. So, um... Oh, there we go. Make it small. Make it big. Interesting. I did not know you could do that. But we'll keep it to normal size for now. Gravel dust, you go to engines. Grant shield, you go here. Um... Jump, we'll go here first. Alright, my plan is fairly simple. I've been doing a lot of, like, get the drone, get the teleport on too, uh, a little too fast. We're going to make a more of a normal run with, like, upgrades and such, so... No more is a bad system, however, scans feel uh, nearby mine platform. Alright, first shot. The eye of a nearby small rebel scout immediately unnecessarily as a threat and engages. It's going to try and get away. It's got lasers and it's got explosives. So let's see here. I want to do what? We're going to go after his ship kind of like this, guess, maybe? No, we'll go like this. We'll go Aramis on his um, piloting and we we'll go hull missiles on his weapons. That won't penetrate my shields. This will, regardless, but whatever. Okay, that's delayed it. We'll go after his weapons with the Armist now if uh, the hull missile misses. Alright, I don't need to worry about him uh, getting away or hitting me, so we'll just focus on using the hull missile to finish him off. Apparently that was an iron bomb, so I kind of uh, misjudged how much damage you could do. But oh well. This should finish him off. Boom. The ship breaks apart and you feel relief. Push on. You barely have time to register a jump completion before your ship warns you of an incoming ship with weapons hot. Alright, he's got explosives and a laser. A, a burst laser, or not burst laser, but a dual laser at that. Um, we'll go weapons on him and we'll go hit his empty sh uh, room there. His laser is going to penetrate my shields uh, easily enough, but oh well. Oh. I apparently took his weapons down that uh, he wasn't too uh, capable of uh, doing anything about. It. Boom! One more hit you finish him off. Oh, this is perfect. Boom. The ship explodes, leaving behind the central question of scrap material. Alright, we're going to do some upgrades. Let's do this, and I'll have uh, double shields. Very nice. There's the rebels, they're coming. There's a nebula over here, so let's push over here and I'll use a nebula to slow them down the rebels in advance. Especially will arm pirate ship, a coach's hand over one of your crew members. No, we will never send any slavers. He's got drones and he's got lasers, but he's not too, too threatening really. So I'm going to go after his piloting and we'll go after his empty room. Hopefully he'll surrender a crew member to me. Okay, is that firing twice? Nope. You know what, I'm actually going to do this because I don't need to dodge um, this. And, you know, having the extra shield pit will mean that I can't have to worry about uh, him hitting me low enough for this to hurt me. And apparently I missed his uh, thing there. Um, he's got four... Alright, it's going to take a couple armor missiles to hurt this guy, so... 
Ah, uh, we'll hull missile down his uh, section there. And hopefully the arm is enough to wake him up. Okay, we surrender, take one of our as tribute. All right, we'll accept our offer. He gave me a mantis, awesome. You'll go on weapons for now. Now, why can't I jump away? The engine's not uh, powered up, right. I took off the uh, engine for uh, the shields. Let's go over here. I'll need to go to the store, so why not go, why you go to the store? Especially, we'll, oh, we'll guess one again. We'll never send our crews to slavers. Okay, this guy's got an actual burst drone. So, or, you know, a combat drone. So it'll actually be more beneficial to me to keep my engines on, I think, for this guy. Um, but what do I want to do here? We'll turn this off and turn the shields on to maximum. And I'll go arm this on his, uh... No, we'll go on his pilot again. Now I've got two shields for this thing to try and penetrate through, so it's probably not going to get through him. I don't really need to dodge him, right? Too much, but it'll help if I do. Okay, we hit his piling down. Let's take off his drone control next, maybe. Okay, there goes his um, drone control a little bit. So he's got some our drone in there, obviously, because this thing's not powered, but something's, you know, this isn't completely destroyed. It's getting fixed too fast. It's a system repair drone, I think. All right, that took his weapons out. So he's got system repair drones, I believe. All right, we'll try and fit, uh, hopefully get him surrounded in our slave. I'm going to bring him right down to one HP, hull, one hull point. Okay, accept your offer. He gave me a human. I'll take that. Okay, you can stay in here and be my door guard. I'm actually really happy he got those uh, slavers. All right, let's go to the Nebula. Slow down the Rebel Advance. A pirate ship arrives shortly after you, joins the factor trying to avoid your ship, you assume with smugglers, attack the pirate. Power up weapons and move into a gauge. He's got teleporters, but uh... Oh, a burst laser. Um... No, we're gonna get hit by that, but whatever. It's gonna be fine, I guess. Um, armor's down his... Weapons first, and then we'll do hull missile on his weapons too if it misses. What do you send over? A mantis. Okay, you're gonna go in here and combat this guy. Okay, hopefully uh, taking out his burst laser will uh, hurt him quite good. Um, let's go after this right here. Maybe it'll surrender. Go here, go here. Oops, I blew him up. I didn't know he had that little uh, hull left. Oh well, I was gonna probably blow him up anyways. Ooh, I took a hit there. Send you both there and send you in here. All right, you didn't really get much from them. So it appears as transferring prisoners, if once you kill them all in battles, it tells what you can. So that would have been a good ship to uh, capture if I teleport, but I don't have those yet. I want to get tele um, teleports though. I got Mantis already. Do this. You go in there. Gravel Duster, you go in here. You go here. You go there. And... Oh, I got fire in my med bay. Go back in here. No, just in case, let's uh, move around and find out if there's any more fires. There was my med bay. Send you in here to help. Put this out. Send in here. I kind of suck that um, there's fires in my ship. You go here. You go here. 
All right, let's jump. Let's go to the nebula still so I can keep the rebels slowed down. Prior ship arrives as an air smuggler, attack to Shepard. He's got missiles and uh, simple lasers, but nothing really too scary. We'll go after his weapons. I'll go after his hull. I'm running out of missiles quite quickly though, so I better watch it. Ooh, I missed. Let's go after uh, his weapons as a hull missile. Okay, that's shot off his weapons. Let's go after his piling with the Armis. Ouch, I took a hit. Go here. Another two shots should be enough to kill this guy. Go after his shields or something. Doesn't really matter where I hit him with the Armis. These next two shits, uh, hits should be enough to finish him off. Boom. Uh, for the bits and pieces, you find the side enough. It's just scary infantry, nothing seems useful. That's too bad. Let's see here. I want to get some power so that I can charge up, uh, you know, start getting my shields powered up. Alright, to store. Um, I may want to go for it for missiles, so. Uh, we'll go here, though. I may not be able to get to store, so I won't worry about it. Uh, let's fight the ship. Mercenaries are worse than rebels. The only honorable courses is against mercies in battle. Alright, he's got a pipe beam and he's got ions. So I want to take out maybe what? Maybe we'll do something like this. I'll go after his auction. I may try and bring this guy down to, uh, you know, no auction and kill him that way. Just for the fun of it. There goes his auction. He'll slowly suffocate now. There goes his weapon slightly. Uh, let's just wait. So we played a waiting game now. Anyways, um, so basically uh, with these ships, uh, why I'm hitting this auction guy and trying to get a fixation on this guy, this guy has a separate room for his auction chamber and a separate room for his engines. He can't get his guys from this area to this area or this area. He's incapable of doing it. So all I have to do is wait for him to asphyxiate and I, and I basically get the achievement. Kind of cheap, but it works. And I guess he can't really hurt me, so I sort of wasted missile hitting his weapon system, but oh well. We'll just slowly wait for him to go down. This is going to take a while, by the way. I mean, he's got to completely deoxidize, which can take a while. But it will go down eventually. This is kind of like that achievement where, you know, on the Osprey, I was just waiting for that drone to slowly die from the beam weapon. It can hurt me, but, uh, you know, hurting it with the, with the giant artillery beam took a while. All right, victory through asphyxiation. He's uh, asphyxiating. He's going to die in a moment. Because there's no way to get his auction into his crew, and then all his crew are going to die. Anyways, for victory through asphyxiation, all you have to do is just reduce the auction level to below 5%. Alright, with the crew dead, you're able to take out the fuel from the storage. You also take all the scrap you can manage. So, we're done. Very easy uh, achievement to get if you find a ship like this. Um, let's go up here. I don't think I'll be able to get to the store, sadly, but oh well. Uh, I can trade missiles for drone parts here, we'll ignore. There's a stress beacon over here. Uh, let's go to it. It might be worth it. You find a source of stress call, a small research station. Alright, let's send my rock crew in. And we got ourselves a shield charge booster. That's actually really good for my ship because I got two pips. So, shield charge booster, 15% uh, boost to my uh, shield recharge. Um, not bad. Let's jump to here. And we got a uh, nearby system for aid and it gave me a system repair drone. And we'll go to the exit. 
And scanners are showing intelligent life forms. Investigate. Try to keep me peacefully. Uh, finally! Okay, so none of your attempts to keep me seem to work. They just stare at you silently. As you prepare to leave, one of them creatures can't just forward and forcefully nudges you away from the ship. He seems to want you to follow him. Eventually, the creatures guide you to an old NG crash ship crash site. Inside, you are able to find and reactivate an NG! So this is why this is an awesome uh, event. When you get, you know, something like that happening. Alright, we're gonna have you go here and... Uh... How are these guys doing? You're up to good shields, you're good engines. We're gonna leave those guys where they are and we'll have these guys be my combat crew. The engine can be like my weapons guy or whatever. Um, Alright, next sector. I can go to rock controlled or rock controlled. Uh, let's go to rock controlled. Har har. Alright, the rock people are a particularly aggressive stance, even towards rock people attacking them apparently. Let's go here. Where do I watch my fuel? As well my missiles. Alright. A ship without life forms within a nearby dense asteroid is giving off a distress call. Shall we investigate? It could be dangerous. With rock plane, you can go through here with and get the thing without uh, problems. Make for a furrow release in a ship without fear of stray asteroids. You find a cane remains as some kind of ship coated in ice or crystal. You send some crew aboard to explore. Nearly everything's eerie or destroyed or identifi unidentifiable, but one of the weapons appears solid and there's a strange stasis pod that catches your eye. Alright, so massive asteroid. Let's um, grab the stasis chamber because there's plenty of time to uh, get the crystal guy. The pod appears to be functioning, but you don't know what it does. Alright, I need to go to the store and get some fuel and missiles and possibly a weapon if it's available. With the local rock summons, so I'm willing to trade with uh, other life forms and options that Manta Crew has postponed his piracy activities to set up shop and correction passing trade. Alright. Um, teleports would actually be really beneficial right now. Just because um, I have the guys for it. We'll sell this because I don't need it. And I guess we'll keep this, even though, uh, you know, whatever. Um, fuel and missiles and all that. This is good. Alright, here's my uh, thinking. I want to buy missiles and fuel. And now this will be enough to tie me over a little bit while we press on. Um, we're going to have to teleport to some ships and capture them basically right now. And this will probably be the first one. A rookie rock cargo ship is taking its oars to literally and took the most direct route through, um, to your destination right through an asteroid field. They're confused and fire one as you jump in. Alright, he's uh, got lasers and um, a beam weapon, but I'm not too scared of him. We're going to do this, send you guys here, and we'll board this guy, I think. Let's teleport on what? Weapons. So he's sending guys after me. There's one rock crew. And I might want to send another pair of rock guys to uh, run interference in these guys, but I might, rather might just have it so I can pull these guys out if needed, I think. Oh. Okay, we're slowly killing these guys, but I've got to pull these guys out. Go in here. Uh, I'll keep that on. Uh, you know what? We're going to pull off the Artemis because I don't need it right now. I'll heal these guys up. And then we'll send them back for round two. I better watch my auction, but I should be good. I should do it like this. I don't need the Earth and missiles. Okay, we're ready to go. Let's send them both over. Do weapons again. And we're slowly going to kill these guys both. Because both my guys are ready to kill them. There goes one. There goes the second. There are no more life arms remaining on the ship. You strip of useful materials. I have a missile from that and scrap. And we're going to pull these guys right off. Go heal up. So the teleports are going to save me missiles right now, which is important. And I got the crew members for it too. I should really get some 
energy for you know all the systems here. Let's do this. I'll do this. And we'll do that. Jump. Let's go here. There's not much to speak in, just a few band depots, strip clean. Let's go up here. A sun. As soon as you arrive, you hear the telltale sounds of teleport and shot the very through the ship. Prepare to burn, fleshy meat sack aliens. Okay, we got some rockmen to fight. Um, let's send you guys and you to go kill them. And I want to do what? I don't need weapons for this guy at the moment, so let's just charge our, our engines and all that. Hope that my human doesn't take too much of a beating here. Ooh! Flames are everywhere! Man, just is slowly killing this guy. Um... Uh, I gotta pull these guys out. Go up here. Send you out, send you in. The NG will at least uh, prevent this guy from attacking this guy. Okay. Alright, that's what I want to see. Lots of uh, dev rock crew. Okay, I've got to watch for the uh, solar flares, but these guys are all injured, so I have to jump now. Um, we'll go here. Hopefully no one's going to board me. You exit, jump surrounded by dirt and rocks. Before long, a blast of is left by a shield, but it, it's not what I'm incoming part. Alright, I don't have to worry about these guys killing my guys, so... Let's see here, you are gonna go... Um... You know what, we're not gonna try and teleport on this guy, because these guys are... Well, I guess I could teleport, there's no real reason not to. Gonna wait for this to, uh... Get better. Send you guys here. Oh, we're good to uh, send these all in here. You know what, we're going to send uh, you this time, Grant, and send you back here. You guys go in there. This guy's got upgrade um, doors this time, so I can't run around his ship, but I can send these guys over to attack his pilot, and then I don't have to worry about them. Alright, well, they're right next to each other, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, they're attacking me quite badly. But I should be able to pull out my guys before they do too much damage. Take your both out, you go in here. Go in here. It's funny how my uh, Rockman here can charge the FTL because there's no one here, but he doesn't need to be there at the moment. Girl Duster, you know what, you're going to go back here and start charging your engine. I'll send my human back over because that's what his job is really to do, board stuff. Alright, and send him back over here. Apparently he took some door damage. Send him in here, kill this guy. Oh, he got some shields. Alright, there's no more life signs on the remaining ship. You strip of useful materials. That's what I like to see. I'll note that I'm sort of saving up scrap for a new weapon. Because I want to get like some lasers or um, just something that I can use that I can save my missiles, basically. Send you both here. Let's jump and... Well, let's go up here. Why not? As a natural warlike species with few intergalactic difficult ties, the rock people have guarded quite a reputation as fearsome pirates. You stumble across one of their ships and they probably love the type. Well, whatever. Um, he's not going to probably do anything too densely effective to me, so we'll just wait for my teleporters to charge up. 
And we'll send my guys along their way. Right there. And it's just another two rock crew. Hopefully these guys will get some good combat experience. Hey my man's able to kill this guy. That'll be cool. Alright, let's pull these guys out. I didn't manage to kill anybody, but they're both good and injured now. Now I'm actually thinking about something. There's a lot of uh, what can I say? Red dots in my um, sector, so I'm actually regretting to get getting that crystal man because he may not be uh, you know something I can pull out, which will suck. Okay, he's dead. Now we just got this guy to kill. Ah, now that the ship has been emptied of hostiles, he's searching for five prisoners who wants to join the crew. I got myself a rock man. He'll make sure it's a good little uh, guy to have on my ship. I guess, let's see here. I've got uh, how many guy crew now? I've got seven crew members, so yeah, I'm really great having that crystal event. It's too bad I got it, I think. But oh well. Um, let's jump to here. I got enough scrap for a weapon now, I think, if I find a store. You encounter a rock vessel and attempt to open trading frequencies, blah, blah, blah. Alright, this guy's got ions and heavy lasers, but he's, that doesn't seem to have anything that can really stop me from uh, really scaring me, so let's send these both guys over. Alright, I should be able to kill both these guys easily enough. Maybe I can kill him in the first go too, that'll be interesting. Mantis will kill that guy. Ah, they're getting too close. Let's just pull him out. Send you both here. This is turning out to be another good start, but it's, it's good just because of all the crew members I've got. And a teleport I was able, able to snag. Go in here. And we'll send you both over to attack their pilot again. And finish them both off. Man kills off the rock man. Man kills off the air rock man. Some life signs in a strip. You strip of useful materials. Send you both in there. Let's jump. I'm not finding any stores apparently. I'll go here. Maybe I'll see a store in one of the few dots that are left. You find a stable rock transfer flying near a beacon. You consider stripping a um, useful parts, but you're unsure why it's there in the first place. Let's strip the ship. A rock patrol ship uh, jumps in while you're salvaging the ship. They message you, filthy pirates, prepare to die. You die explaining your mission to will cancel them of, your, of them of your need. I got my uh, share of uh, stuff from them, but oh well. You gotta fight these pirates. He's gonna be able to hurt me, so... I'm a little bit tempted to hit his uh, ship down a little bit. We'll send you both... We'll send you guys this time. And send him in. We'll send the armors to hit off his weapons. And why not? We'll do this. Okay, that'll hammer his weapons enough that I don't have to worry about them for a bit. Let's uh, do this. How are you doing on uh, combat? You're doing pretty good. Okay, let's pull him out. Heal him up. Yay! So he's got uh, green mastery, he's got green mastery. He'll get there soon enough. Wait for a teleporter to recharge. Send them in here. Oh, they weren't in here. Oh, they got the other guy coming now. There's Battle of is piling in a moment. Alright, we find a prisoner who offers to join my crew. 
We got Zoltan now. All right, so we got full crew. Uh, you will go where? You go to weapons, I think, because... Uh, yeah, I don't really need you in weapons for the moment. Now I got a free power that I can put into there. There we go. Okay. Um, full crew. And there's a store. Awesome. I want to go here first. Yeah, we'll go here first, though. You see Molten Divergent? Oh well, go here. Another sun. Unusual solar activity in this region means that you need to get out quick. The rock pirates nearby apparently think otherwise as they move in to attack the ship. I, I don't want to teleport on this guy because he's got med bays, but I can deal with this guy easily enough without, you know, that. Go after his weapons, go after this. I got all these guys to repair my ship. Lots of crew members on my ship. Okay, that stopped his burst laser. And we'll just... Boom. I took down that. Uh, send... No, we won't do that. Let's do this. I'll send you over here. You should be finished off in a moment, as soon as those next two fi missiles fire. I'll send you guys in here, and I'll send you out here. Do this. Oh, here is a damage. That's annoying. Oh, well, the next armist missile should be enough to finish him off. Boom. A little bit more. Ship explodes. All right. Let's do this. I'm going to get hit by that solar flare, but oh well. Go to the store where it's safe. Door system is on fire. You cross paths with rock ships returning from a rare mission. All right. Let's see here. I don't have any weapons in here to buy. I could get cloaking. But uh, let's do this. 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 Uh, we'll sell the damage stasis pod in case I find some useful augments that'll come around. One of the, you know, situations where it's better to sell it than to chance it. Oh, we got the fire put out now. Do this. Hopefully it'll deoxidize quick enough before a door explodes. Probably unlikely. No, it did, uh, it did, uh, deoxidize fast enough. Alright, let's, uh, upgrade my ship a little bit. I want to get some upgrades, and... Thinking about, I want to get the med bay upgrade. Do this and do this. That will let me get uh, a little bit of stuff done, so I can shift mail power around easily enough. And we'll save the rest of the scrap for a new weapon when I get one. So jump, go to uh, the exit. Holy crap! A weapon is just floating in uh, space. There's a Hermes missile. So the Hermes missile, it's uh, fires one missile, does free damage, pierces all shields. It's got fairly slow uh, reload time, but whatever, it's still useful. I mean, it'll be good for like, you know, hitting uh, actual systems. Um, the only bad thing about it is that it takes free power to use, so, you know, arms is probably better in that category. But oh well. Alright, this is looking a lot, like a lot better uh, run than before. I'm really happy about that. Um... Let's see here. Let's go to the rock control sector next. Now we'll go to Mantis. Now we'll go to rock controlled. Why not? Do it again. The rock people are particularly aggressive stance toward alien races trespassing their space. You should check carefully here. So this will be the next sector. I'll stop the recording here. Hope you enjoyed.